disappointed. As it happened, it turned out to be an absolutely dreadful production, which I was thoroughly ashamed of, and I put the entire blame for that on the director and the, the company who did that play. Whoa. This year, he's and taken on a role which your life on the old Mahatma vs. Gandhi, inspired by a Gujarati novel, is an actual account of events based on letters written by Mahatma Gandhi and his son, Harilal Gandhi. As far as I am concerned, Bapu, the play explores the anguish of father and his troubled relationship with his son. A Mahatma with feelings, emotions and fears, caught between his responsibilities as a nation builder and as a father who sees his son going his own way. Each one of us has to find the thing that can... In many ways, Gandhi has written many of his letters that he thought he was one of his bravest son because he stood up for his own, whatever he wanted to, whatever he believed, he stood up to that. But both of them stood up on their own. So they had this relationship of intense respect for each other and yet at the same time they were poles apart in what their search was in life. We gather for prayers, we become one with nature. We live the simple and happy life of farmers. In portraying the human side of the Mahatma, Nasir is relying on his gut feel and imagination rather than any method. It is a fallacy that expensive luxuries are good for health. Take sugar, it is expensive and it is harmful. An actor goes basically by instinct. Now, that is not to negate the importance of research and the fact that one, if playing a historical character, must know all the facts and more than the facts as well. But uh, basically, you go by your instinct and you go by your imagination. And uh, you try to discover within yourself the potential of being a person like Gandhi or someone as great as that. Mahadev, this is not a question of Muslim or of Islam. This is nothing but Hari Lal going astray. And there are no More importantly, the actor is trying to remove his recognizable acting habits to add freshness to his style. I do not wish to hide my sorrow, but at the same time, I want to clarify that I do not feel bad because Hari Lal has embraced Islam. If I could manage to, to roughly resemble him, and managed to communicate a sense of truth and a conviction in what he's saying, I thought the, the battle would be won. If I could manage to restrain myself from my own acting reflexes so that those things about my acting which are highly recognizable uh, are not there, that is the first step. The lack of devotion, the unfocused mind... All the play which has already been staged in Hindi Gujarati and Marathi is being performed in English for the first time in the country. Now imagine a soldier leaving for the front. Of course he will carry his gun and some ammunition, but what if he decides to carry along provisions?